how he fixed it. So, we got Sex Resin Cocoa Puffs versus... We like sandwiches. Meta Knight starting off with some combos. I think there's a team in sandwiches. No? Yeah, I, I don't know. You know, hey, hey, I'm selectively bad at spelling. <laughs> so don't ask me. Back to the match. Oh, a team grab. All right, whoa, okay. Cheek off stage makes it back. It's, 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 it's Cheek. What do you want from Didn't he play Mario originally in the, the set we saw? Oh. What do you think made him switch? I'm not sure. I think you know. I think he probably just feels more comfortable with um, with picking the best. I don't know. Ugh. It doesn't matter what character he's picking if he's gonna run to F smashes like that. Meta Knight being out of jumps. Jigglypuff. Oh no, Jigglypuff. Is. Just someone fell asleep at the wheel there. Someone rested Down. at the wheel there. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> All right, so we got Jug. We got, we're getting combos right now on Luigi by the Sheik. But he should be able to get back on just fine. And we're seeing Jimmy from doing a good job of walling him out. He's trying to take advantage of that bad recovery, but yeah, it's just leading to more and more damage. See, I guess what I'm thinking about is uh, Luigi, uh, Sheik probably is a way better matchup against Luigi than Mario does. I mean, at least pre-patch, Mario used to lose. No, Mario, is, I think it's a good matchup for uh, either way. I think it's just a, at this point, comfortable. it's just a preference, right? Just more comfortable with it. But now Green Team has, like, stabilized, and they got possession of the stage, right? Uh, like, spacing on uh, Meta Knight's up smashes. Right. It's looking really crisp, actually. Oh, that's dead. Oh, my goodness. Meta Knight loses his first stock. Yeah. Luigi is still alive, so we need to see him like tank it out right now. That was very ill advised up really here, but risky he got option. Stage. But he makes it back, grabs a ledge. That's what you want to do. You want to fast follow a ledge up the yeah. opening. Yeah. He, he tries to go off stage against Jigglypuff. He needs to be a little bit more conservative right now. He's at 144. Yeah, keep playing the stock tank game. Wow. F smash is the MVP clearly in the first part of this game. Okay, maybe we should go. Oh, nice, nice decision to go for that tornado I think he did. Ooh. He's doing a good job of surviving. He needs to be a little bit more conservative, like, right now, because actually probably going to hit him and kill him right, like, right, yeah, now, right now. Send him off stage. Maybe he's going to do a... Oh. You don't see a lot of uh, Luigi's really do tornado recoveries unless it's absolutely necessary. Oh, no, they do, they do it pretty often. They, they kind of have to, especially the ones that know how to do it without using the jump. But right now, I'm really impressed with this Luigi right now. He is making sure that no matter what, he keeps that stock for his buddy. Yeah, doing the cheeky uh, crawling On around. the flip side, you got to look at the Jilly Puff and be like, why is he not dead yet? As soon as I open my mouth, he rests him of all options. <laughs> That's great. Player 1 defeated, followed quickly by Player 2 being. defeated. Towards the middle of the match, when they was able to get both um, red team characters off the stage and regain control of center stage, that's when the battle changed. Um, before that, it was pretty much Juggle City, um, especially on Luigi. That's why he was at high percent. Yeah, just the, uh, I think, his control of the stage, especially with F Smash, being such a threatening move, caused red team to give up space a well, lot. He, he made it threatening. Like, he, um, it's, you know... I was surprised he got that many kills. He only got two F Smash kills, but you saw how that changed the way they approached him, and it made it easier to figure out how to get around their moves. So we're now around Final Destination, and now it's Villager Jigglypuff versus Midnight Luigi. I have not seen this combination before, but it might be an indication that the red team wants to go very defensive right now. Wow, F Smasher. Villager is not having fun right now. Yeah, getting juggled. Start using that frame three nair to get out of bad situations. Yeah, you know? yeah. Out, out of shield options is one of the uh, strengths of Villager for sure. Needs to make sure to get grabbed right there off the stage. Okay. Jigglypuff gets actually charged up smash, doesn't get punished. That was close. 
Another F smash kill. What is going on here? We are There's not. It's a really not, fast move. We are not respecting the. Oh, that That's might be a uh, footstool. Amazing footstool. I don't know. I think right. he just ate a what a bowling ball there. Yeah, I think man, I just did the dust right now. But that's the third F Smash kill, I believe, in this set, and it's it's before now, but it's clearly MVP. This Midnight is very scary. It's a very scary character in Smash 4. People think just because he's not Brawl, he's good, but he's in fact, you know, very good. Well, people still don't think that, because, I mean, we've seen too many examples where that is, where he's clearly still a viable character. He's just played different. Yeah, you have to be a lot more careful than neutral. A lot more dash attacks. Villager goes for it. He's going I, for the uh, up the vanish pledge. I respect that. You know, you should, you know, it's almost like wow, um, how Ryu will throw you a uh, platform above them to make it a little bit safer to throw out. He's got to be a little bit more careful about that. Man at 95 percent. Jilly Club at 96 in the air, and Villager trying to edge guard. Just stay alive at 68, 72 now. Wow. Dimensional came mind. Very, moves. very slick. The wherewithal to just pull it out the right time. Up B. Oh. Out. Uh, Charged maybe for a little too long. A little bit of confusion as to what to do to a sleeping Jilly Puff. Cost, cost him a stock. It's uh, surprisingly even, actually. I was uh, questioning. The, uh, the switch to Villager, mostly because Meta Knight actually does really well against Villager. Hmm. But it's proving me wrong. Well, as soon as you say that, he dies, so yeah, uh, commentary is not. Commentary is Like, immediately after you said that, oh, he's doing a great job, he dies. <laughs> uh. Dude, Puff's trying to manhandle the Meta Knight. Can you get back up? Oh, oh well. I thought he was out of jump. Well, now he's out of jump. No, he's, he's, oh, he's wow. Jump Jigglypuff. Da -da -da. I think he grabbed the edge. Because he got hit. He grabbed the edge. He got hit in the two-frame window, so he got his jumps back. Okay. Yeah, that, you know, that makes, that's the only thing I can think of. I thought for sure he was dead. That was very lucky. <laughs> very fortunate for him. And he tries to make Luigi pay for trying to come back on the stage. And, uh, unfortunately, it doesn't, doesn't work out. Luigi at 124. I mean, 127. Meta Knight is throwing out the F smash. That's again. it. Yeah. Now we have a 2v1. Villager. He'll advise. I think Villager has the tools to do 2v1. Yeah, he's going to have to use that to like, maximize his Stay ledge. Stay near the ledge. Too. Yeah. Probably be the best option. I like the uh, shenanigans he does with Deloitte, but. Hmm. No one that's what doing. Oh, no punch. That was close. Ooh, is he dead? Okay. That was good. Huh. At 104, we're looking at Mad Knight Edge starting for the win right here. And up smash, That's an up smash. almost does it. Ooh. That was Obviously great DI. Can't take like, any more. Oh, man. oh, I just got it. Quiz now. We like sandwiches. Oh, <laughs>